deserved a shutout. I know you weren't on the field right there at the end, but uh, I'm sure y'all wanted a zero on the board. Uh, that's definitely, you know, we pride ourselves in stopping offenses from scoring on us, and that's one of our goals uh, going into the game, never let an uh, offense score you, because you can't score, you can't win. And like just when the twos got in there, they didn't take advantage of the opportunity, but we just, it was a combination of a few things, so we'll just have to come back next week and go to work and make those corrections. Do you kiddingly uh, get on those guys, the number two guys, for allowing them to score? Oh, yeah, I, everyone was pretty hot about it. You know, we don't. That's, that's, we take pride in take pride in that, and then after that, they showed something like 386 game where they've like scored consecutive. 300, yeah, 367. Yeah, 67, and like we just proud ourselves in stopping them. But it is what it is. We just have to make those corrections this week and go from there. Can you just talk about what this means? I mean, so much build up, so much talk about the Georgia Florida series, how they took out the school away since 1990. What it means to you guys to do this? Oh, uh, it's big time. You know, coming down to uh, Jacksonville. Uh, Playing them big time robbery game and just doing what we do, playing all style of football and pretty much you score and everything else speaks for itself. A lot of people said you guys have won a lot of games easily this year, particularly in the conference, but okay, let's see what happens for the week. In your minds, are you thinking that too? Were you thinking, yeah, we need to make a statement this week? Uh, we feel like we need to make a statement each and every game we go out and play. So just Florida was the next opponent on the schedule. So we just had to get, play the style of defense that we placed on offense and just team ball. And it just feels great to get an uh, awesome victory versus those guys. Y'all kept the pressure on Franks pretty much the whole game. Was that the kind of game plan to give him, uh, you know, get in his face and not let him have a lot of time, which he had to rush a lot of throws? Uh, definitely. You know, that's big, you know, affecting the quarterback, getting him out of his comfort zone and doing those type of things that, that make a quarterback throw some, make some ill-advised throws and, like, just get out of the pocket. So that's always big. When you hear Florida players make comments like they made over the last week, do you guys let that be a factor with how you prepare for the game? How do you balance what Kirby wants you to do with knowing that they're saying things like that? Well, you always hear type things like that, but you can't let it phase it. Like in the SEC, a game never been won by talking, so that is what it is. It's not always 